for several years, the nursing department has educated majors in the HERS department in cardiac rehab or exercise science or motion movement in, the, in pharmacology. And I thought, well, this course would really fit into an online course because uh, there was enough students that needed to take it. You could offer it year round. They didn't have to be on campus. It would be totally online. And um, the, the support for creating an online course was here. And SoftShock um, helps you to create uh, lessons and the lessons can be interactive um, so that the student um, kind of learns a little bit about content and then they do an activity or they do a little uh, test yourself quiz and so that they're doing a lot more interacting with the material than they would if it was just a PowerPoint and they were reading the slides. You can create a crossword puzzle. You can create a table or a chart. You can have um, flashcards. You can have a photo album uh, where you have um, pictures and descriptions of the pictures. You can have YouTube uh, videos. Um, in the quiz little self-assessment piece, they have matching questions, multiple choice, true or false, multiple selection, um, short answer and essay. At the end of the lesson they can actually submit um, to you through email a completion score which will um, give the score of any kind of activities that you had in the program. Um, it will also tell you how much time and what day they actually access that program. The biggest thing I think that was uh, strange to me was this increased my interaction with the students even though I haven't seen but maybe two of them who have showed up in my office um, I feel like I know every one of these students much better being online um, I send out surveys at, at the end of every semester on Qualtrics and I've gotten very very good um, evaluations from that. All of the students felt that the course objectives have been met by the lessons, the soft chalk lessons, and that the course was effective. These have been the best um, student evaluations I have gotten from students other than being in the clinical setting where I only have eight to nine students. So I've got 50 students in this online environment and I, I get pretty good feedback from them.